So we're here at the Blue Springs State Park and we're gonna go take a look at the manatees. Let's go. Hey guys, thanks for watching today's video. If you want to see more from us, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel. here in Central Florida and in this park right now because of the season there are 278 manatees here so we're gonna go try and find them. Hi. Oh. <laughs> oh no. I don't know. He looks like, he like, I don't know. He doesn't look friendly. He does. He looks like he wants to attack. No, he looks like he wants to attack. Look, 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 look. <laughs> I'm scared of him. We've seen birds, but we still are on the hunt for the manatees, so there's 278. We're sure to find them. Make sure to follow our social media accounts where we'll be posting more content related to this YouTube channel. Well, the manatees are beautiful and they're so prehistoric looking, which is pretty cool. You don't really find a lot of animals, um, you know, that have that certain prehistoric look, kind of like elephants, but this is a water body one so i don't know it's pretty cool it's been a while i grew up in florida manatees are everywhere but it's been a while since i've seen them so happy to be here and see them. So here at Blue Springs State Park, they have manatees right now in the water. Usually when the manatees aren't here, you can actually swim in the water, so that's super fun. But when the manatees are here, you are not allowed to swim in the water. You're not allowed to harass the manatees. Obviously leave the nature alone. When they're not here, you're more than welcome to swim. So that's kind of cool. You have the option to either view manatees or swim right here in the water.
here we have the cave so you can actually go cave diving here uh, right now it is closed also along with the swimming because the manatees are in the water they don't allow you to do any swimming or diving activities when the manatees are here but when the manatees are not here different seasons you're more than welcome to come here if you're into diving you go into the cave and that's kind of a cool thing so you have lots of options <laughs> One thing about this place is when you come here you will notice there are squirrels everywhere. Totally normal for a Floridian, for being in Florida, there's squirrels everywhere. That's not unusual, but the squirrels here, you'll find them running along these um, posts and they are not scared of people at all, which is what you need to be concerned of. Uh, when the animals are scared, then they run away, that's okay, but when they're not scared, that's when you need to be a little more concerned because you know they're just not afraid of you it actually reminds me a lot to the monkeys in costa rica they would walk on these and um, the monkeys in bali they would actually chase people and even steal from them sometimes so just because you see an animal and it's really friendly that's usually not a good thing <laughs> Welcome to the Thursby house. This house was built in 1872, so it has a lot of history here. Um, it's here in the Florida Park Service, and they work hard to preserve this historical building so it can be present for the future and future generations to go inside and look. Right now it is closed, but usually they have some well-preserved antiques and a little bit of memorabilia and things from the 1800s, so you can learn more about what was going on in this area, about this kind of colonial style building um, and this house and it's a kind of cool place to stop when you're in the area so you can check it out read about it and next time when it's open you can visit inside Behind me right here is the area where you can come and rent a kayak for yourself, for your family, for somebody you just come to the park with. You can actually take the kayaks out on your own into the water or you can hire a guide that will take you on a guided kayak tour and will tell you a little bit about the area and will just basically give you a nice tour around this beautiful lake water area. So I just got barked at by a bird. I was literally just standing there and I heard Ruff! <laughs> and I looked up and there was a big, very big bird. So birds do bark, I have heard that before. Mm -hmm. 